stoned at the doorstep. FNL Lacrosse, only on ESPN New Hampshire. Hour number two. Nick and Astis sitting in here on FNL Lacrosse. Joined by my co-hosts, Russ Moyer of 603 Lax, Chris Hetler, head coach at the Dairy Field School. 603-883-9900 is the number. Jam-packed hour number two on the way. UMass head coach Greg Canella will join us at the bottom of the hour. Trying to find out a little bit more of the pipeline he's got going with local talent. Turning into future Minutemen. We might check in with the Bishop Girton head coach as well, Chris Cameron. He's got BG in a big uh, big game down in, in Connecticut. What, what what would you label that as, an exhibition? Yeah, that's currently. Preseason? Yeah, that's a preseason scrimmage, but that's the Connecticut State Champs versus New Hampshire State Champs, so it's, uh, it's a big game, big right. game to put us Five, on the scene. 5-3 BG at the half. There that's the last update we had. So we will hopefully uh, get him on the phone immediately following that game. That game is at Fairfield prep so he'll be joining us obviously uh via the phone but first it's time for our swag bag it's a weekly segment talking about new gear and of course it's all located at sports stop of new hampshire which is your locally owned and operated one-stop shop for everything lacrosse sports stop of new hampshire carries all brands of lacrosse stop uh, sports stop of new hampshire carries all brands of lacrosse equipment excuse me for both boys and girls, it's easy to get to, and they are partnered with one of the country's largest dot-com retailers. So if they don't have it, they can get it. Whether it's beginner packages, team sales, or a huge selection of restringing supplies, Sports Stop of New Hampshire knows your team. Sports Stop of New Hampshire, 273 South River Road in Bedford. Call 603-606-1921 or email lacrosse at sportstopnh.com. Joining me now is Mike Armstrong, the manager of Sports Stop of NH. Welcome to the show, Mike. Hey, guys. How's it going? We are good, sir. Good morning. Um, good morning. Tell me a little bit about Sports Stop of New Hampshire. I know you guys are located over there in South Bedford. How did you partner up with Roger Howe, and, and, and how's it been going? Give me a little history of the store. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I've been uh, been doing lacrosse retail for seven years now. Once Roger started, decided to open up the store, I was uh, I was on board right off the bat. Uh, locally owned and operated, I'm going in uh, in our third season now, providing lacrosse equipment for the local teams and players. Um, you know, we we really try to try to keep our staff ex- you know, experienced and knowledgeable, so that we can really focus on educating our customers on what it is they're buying. Uh, there's so many products out there now, so we're, we really try to narrow it down to best fit that specific player. Mm. So it's really kind of hands on, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Mike Armstrong joining us, our swag bag segment here on FNL Lacrosse. What's new this week at the store? Well, uh, there's a few products, actually. I'm going to go over uh, new for the 2014 season. Uh, first one, go with the Brian Clutch 3 head. Uh, Brian's brought back one of their you know their top-selling heads with the same old design, but they've integrate, integrated their new Cortex sidewalls, so it adds stiffness without, uh, without compromising weight. Uh, the side tie shaft by STX. Uh, the, that one's been another top seller by STX over you know, the past few years. But this year they split it into two different models. Uh, the side tie Surgeon, which has a thinner wall, a little bit lighter, mm-hmm. and the side tie Stallion, which is a thicker wall, more for durability and the heavy hitting players. Uh, yeah. Warrior again. Uh, Warriors brought back another glove regulator. Now they have the Impact technology with their their thumb to provide lightweight protection. And uh, finally, Cascade came out with a new helmet. Uh, it's always a always a fun thing when Cascade comes out with something. They very rarely release new helmets. But uh, this year they got the R. Uh, they've combined the best aspects of the CPXR and the Pro 7, two of their top-selling helmets of all time. And uh, they're using the same 7 technology seen in the previous helmets for high-impact concussion protection. And now they've added the Poron XRD foam uh, for even more concussion protection on the low-impact side. And that stuff is all new, huh? Wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, they, they release new stuff like crazy. Mike Armstrong, Sports Stop of New Hampshire, our guest. Any deals this week? 
Uh, this week, uh, we got the actually the STX Alliance handle, which is a, a composite handle by STX that's um, down now, one twenty nine ninety nine. It used to be used to be one of the most expensive handles out there. Now it's a little bit more affordable. Mm. Uh, and before I let you go, Mike, just tell me a little bit about the traffic in the store, some of the buzz. I'm sure you have some conversations with familiar faces that are repeat customers in there. I mean, the bottom line is that, that updating, maintaining, and uh, I suppose rotating equipment pieces is very important if you want to get an edge. Um, would you agree with that statement, A, and B? Uh, was, was I correct in kind of summing up the scene in terms of coming on, on a one-on-one basis in the store? Yeah, absolutely. Now, I, I think uh, Russ touched on it earlier. The the stick in lacrosse is, you know, it becomes your best friend. It's something that really needs to be maintained. Uh, the pocket is just as important as the actual pieces. Um, so, yeah, that, I think that, that keeping keeping everything rotated and keeping things fresh um, it helps out a lot. But yeah, the the one on one that we have at the stores is really, you know, one of a kind. We we really try to keep keep things with the customers, you know, right there and then and educating them on what they're buying and, you know, why they're buying it and things like that because there's just so much out there right now. Mm. Mike, appreciate the time. Let's talk again soon. All right. Sounds good. Thanks for having me. That's Mike Armstrong, Sports Stop of New Hampshire, 273 South River Road in Bedford. Call 603-606-1921 or email lacrosse at sportsstopnh. Dot com. Russ, he gave you a shout out. Yeah, I mean, I gotta say, you know, the equipment it's is so far behind me at this point. I can't keep up with it, but those guys certainly know it. And uh, and a shameless plug of the week, they're actually the only place right now carrying those six hundred three lakh shooters too. So if you want mm. one of those, run on down there to Sports Stop too. It, it, but he was right, right, in terms of how important equipment maintenance is huh. to the sport, right? Without question. I mean, the sticks today are so much more advanced than they were ten years ago, let alone. 15 years ago um and, and really yeah i mean it becomes your best friend you're all about your stick and i mean we do tryouts all the time with the elite programs and then and obviously coach with this high school team you know the kids are always ah oh, my stick's throwing low it's doing this it's doing that you know i, I i'm not big into that but the, the reality is the stick is a big part of your play so you can adapt it to what you're up to and then and the same with the gear you know the helmets you talked about i think coach hetler's uh, cougars have this year Really nice. We, we do have the new R's. We're, we're really liking them a lot. Uh, you know, I'll give another plug to, to Sports Stop and Mike there. I think the other nice part about them is that they not only – they don't just string the stick for you and give it to you. They teach the kids about why it throws the way it does. They, they string the pocket a certain way. They ask the kid, you know, how, how do you want it to throw? What are you looking for to get out of your stick? And they try and educate the kids about how to maintain it. And, and you know, obviously they'd like repeat customers, but I, I think they, they're about education. And ultimately, if they can teach a kid how to string a stick as well, that's a great thing. Mm. Um, I think more kids need to learn and understand how their stick throws. You know, sticks break during the game. You got to fix it real quick. You can't. We'd love to have a Mike Armstrong on the bench with us, but we don't yeah. always have one. So you got to you got to be dependent on yourself sometimes too. But mm. and there's lacrosse guys over there. In addition yeah. oh, to yeah. Mike. Of course, Roger Howe, who's a yep. big yep. part of the Bedford youth programs for years, Bedford JV coach. Uh, so Roger Howe, Mike Armstrong, those guys over there, you know you're in good hands, I suppose, equipment-wise, when you head over to Sports Stop of NH, and they're going to sponsor our weekly swag bag segment. So tune in here on FNL Lacrosse Weekly for new deals, new equipment, Very cool. et cetera. Um, Want to shift gears here a little bit?